Sometimes, in a stolen moment of stillness, a breath of escape from the chaos of life, I find a space, a place, to hit pause, contemplate, reflect and dream. Where am I going and how do I get there? In these moments, I realise it's not the destination that is important, or even the route I take, but the journey itself. Journeys present challenges, physical and mental. My strength is tested in both body and mind. Physically, I am prepared. Fear must be conquered. Doubt erased with focus locked in. I don't buy into a journey of self-discovery. You don't find out who you are, because you are who you want to be. It's about choice. The choices we make determine the life we lead. With my body and mind, I have all the tools I could ever require. To not use what I have been given would be the biggest tragedy of all. My surroundings are my inspiration. My body is the tool for my art, the movement of my meaning. Everyone has a story to tell. I illustrate mine with shifts in position, posture and speed. My actions describe my feelings. My mood dictates the style, the orientation and finesse. Within my movement there is purpose, not confined by physical constraints like walls or stairwells. I place obstacles in my way and I will simply adapt and overcome them. And so this is how I choose to express myself. Leaping from concrete to rail, no wall is too high to climb. With every fibre of my being poised, my muscles detonate through every movement. No half measures and no holding back. For every action, there is an equal and opposite reaction. Acceleration into launch, taking flight, pounding brick and stone, core bracing, impacting to land once more on solid ground, consuming every quantum of energy I have. With a deep breath, I prime my senses. Once again, time stands still. Rooftop to rooftop, I'm on top of the world. The adrenaline fuel elation that surges within is addictive. It's what keeps me hooked, keeps me training, and keeps me constantly striving towards greater heights. Once again, I find myself in territory familiar, yet subtle differences alert my receptors, momentarily casting doubt and arousing fear. The jumps may alter in appearance, but beyond the surface, they are just as those I have faced and conquered before. My lines are carefully learned, in my head I've blocked my moves. The preparation is all, fail to prepare, prepare to fail. Foundations must be solid and grounded deep. My objective, to be strong, to be useful, to be free and to be the best I can be. I aspire to achieve, I dream to feel wholly alive. And in my actions, show those who doubt I have the means to follow the path of happiness and success. With my mind and physique aligned, my lens of perception cleansed. There is no wall too high and no gap too vast. The world is mine.